Welcome back to the course, Complete Guide to Essential Oils and Aromatherapy. This is Marcus Hain, your instructor, and this is section one, uh, continuing on the introduction to this course just to get you guys familiarized and acquainted with this, and this is lesson two, where I'm going to cover uh, the main, most important topic of discussion, what is aromatherapy? So to start off, let me go ahead and give you guys the bare basic def definition so you guys understand what the basic idea of aromatherapy is. So aromath aromatherapy is the use of essential oils and ar aromatic plant extracts uh, in baths or massages. So to give you guys some facts about uh, aromatherapy, the first is that there are not only uh, physical benefits that like you guys may have already known about or heard about, but there are also numerous psychological benefits that have been proven through studies, testing, and uh, experiments ran by various doctors. So that's something definitely very key to remember. Uh, the next thing that you guys want to remember is the fact that there's over 90 essential oils that are currently available for use and there are always potential uh, or more potential for new oils to be discovered because they come from nature so we may have many many more essential oils and plants out there that can do various things for us but we just do not know about it yet. Uh, number three is that products uh, that have synthetic ingredients are not recommended to use. So there are some essential oil related products out there in the market, but if they contain synthetic ingredients, you're not getting the full effect that you should be getting. So in those cases, it does not do you the same type of uh, justice. So that is why we highly, highly recommend that you guys do not use those types of products. Um, and lastly, fragrance or perfume oils are not as the same thing as essential oils. There's been some scandals and some controversies in the past of some individuals that have um, been marketing fragrance perfumes or these fragrances as essential oils, but that is completely inaccurate and that's something that you guys definitely want to be careful of and want to avoid. So be sure that you guys don't get caught up in that trap. Um, so that, those are some basic facts on aromatherapy. And lastly, what can aromatherapy do for you? So number one, it can help you with skin problems, infections, respiratory ailments, emotional effects, and many, many other things. Uh, I could make a course just on the number of different things that aromatherapy can do for you. There are thousands and thousands of different benefits that each recipe mixture combination and plant has. But most importantly, it can help you live not only a healthier life, but a better life. And in the future sections, I'm also going to discuss with you all the direct benefits and applications of some of the most uh, popularized essential oils and the ones that are available right now. So that's it for this section. Thanks so much for uh, joining me. I'll catch you guys on the next one, guys.